We are in the starboard engine uh, engine pit or crank pit looking aft. There's the uh, eccentrics and eccentric rods for the aft low pressure cylinder. Here's the uh, crank rod and cross bearing. And then above that, the piston rod for the aft low pressure piston or cylinder. Here's the intermediate uh, uh, crosshead guide, crosshead, crank rod, and above that piston rod for the intermediate cylinder. You can see that there are uh, basically sumps and drains. The amount of oil that gushes through this, uh, that thr the bearing is then controlled and drained into the crank pit, which would pretty much be filled with oil. Ahead of that, and beyond this framing, that geared wheel is for the uh, turning motor. It will turn the engine over while it's warming up at a rate of a little, of one re uh, revolution for every eight minutes, or actually a little more than eight minutes. There's the uh, Stevenson linkage and eccentric rods. That's for the uh, inter valves for the intermediate cylinder. Forward of that is the valve rod, the valve and re valve linkage for the high pressure cylinder valves. You can see the massive uh, framing that attaches directly to the engine foundation, which is in multiple pieces. You can see a joint where the two are attached, and they are in turn bolted solidly to these uh, hull framing members.